It's a bear, it's mobile. They, they don't really stay in one place all the time. Multiple sightings of a bear in Delaware. Officials in the first state are now on the lookout, but is this the same animal spotted in Delaware County earlier this week? Now, wildlife officials in Delaware and in Pennsylvania are working together trying to track down the elusive black bear. This after several sightings just this morning. The bear apparently popped up three times today in the area of 95 in Claymont. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo is there live, and Matt, bears are pretty rare in Delaware. That's right, so rare that Delaware State Wildlife doesn't have any bear traps of their own. And today's bear sightings here in Claymont near Wilmington follow several other bear sightings over in Delaware County. Security video from Springfield, Delaware County captured a 200 pound black bear over the weekend roaming around by a swimming pool. It's very unusual. Wildlife officials aren't yet 100% sure, but they believe it's the same bear that was seen some 20 miles away this morning. By Philadelphia Pike and Manor Avenue in Claymont, Newcastle County. If you see it, like I said, back away slowly. Now neighbors have their eyes peeled looking for it. I can't imagine a bear being here. I've seen deer, but not a, never a bear. There's been several black bear sightings in recent days over in Delaware County. A bear was first seen Friday near Villanova, then later in Marple, Springfield, Alden, and Collingdale. Now Delaware Natural Resources Police are talking about borrowing a bear trap from the Pennsylvania Game Commission. The bear would have to be concentrated and stay in one area, and the only reason it would do that is if it had a food source to continue to go back to. It certainly feels cozy in this bear trap. Here's how it works. Once the bear is inside, it'll reach for some food on this pedestal and when it presses it, that's when the door behind me closes shut. When it gets into a populated area, there are a lot of dumpsters, so it's like a buffet for a bear or somebody's beehives maybe that you'd have out. Like Winnie the Pooh would go in and get the honey from the beehives. That's what bears do. And officials warn people not to approach the bear if you see it. Reporting live in Claymont, Newcastle County, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. We are glad you've made your way out of that trap. Thank you, Matt.